Well, we're back on board now, the Fly B, which is about to be going off to Heathrow. Paul Quine is the, the uh, pilot, the, the captain, and uh, Paul, the story is fantastic with you. I mean, we've just got to hear about this, because this is something that you're well used to doing from the Isle of Man. I didn't even get that, that you go back that long ago since the last time there were flights from the Isle of Man to Heathrow. That's correct, yes, Paul. Um, yeah, I worked for Manx Airlines, so uh, I was uh, actually in command back in 2002 of, of the last uh, Manx Airlines flight, which wasn't from Heathrow. Uh, it was actually from Birmingham to the Isle of Man, but uh, yeah, we used to uh, obviously fly uh, three times daily to Heathrow uh, with Manx, so uh, it almost feels as if the wheels turn full circle, as it were. And it's very exciting for everyone to have this service back, and I'm, I'm sure, you know, I know you can't speak for the thing, but it's great, isn't it, as a service to have it? I think it's excellent, yeah. It's both for the leisure um, traveller, which obviously, you know, I mean, if you're talking about um, international airports, then Heathrow is, is really is an A-list airport. Um, it serves every continent on the planet except Antarctica. So, so for connecting uh, onto um, uh, holidays long haul, it's, uh, it's absolutely excellent. And for the business traveller as well, I, I feel it's... Um, it allows the Isle of Man to start punching its weight again in uh, in in, the, in 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 terms of business. So uh, hopefully um, it serves both uh, markets uh, equally well. I hear we're going to get the big send off today. Is that true? So I've been led to believe. Yes, I think the fire brigade <laughs> are going to be called out to give us uh, a salute. So uh, yeah, it all adds to the occasion, and, and, and I'm sure it's uh, it's uh, just a nice touch. Yeah, nice touch from the airport. Now. Any challenges that Heathrow brings differently? Because I mean, you've got all those big planes coming in. You know, you're one of the smaller ones. Do you, what challenges are there any? Uh, not not specific challenges as such. Obviously, it's a it's a busy airport. It's you know, the busiest international airport in the world. Um, but we're we're quite used to flying in there. It's not it's not like um, the company don't already fly there. We fly there from another uh, four destinations. But uh, it, because of of, of the manner of the uh, of, of the way it is then it's uh, it's very well run so everything knits in together and everything sort of runs like a like a sewing machine really right well you're all set everything done pretty much ready to go yeah and uh, we'll we'll be uh, seeing how it all goes and it's fantastic i think october the minute is booking time and then who knows after that so uh, if you want to go to Heathrow, I'll get on with your bookings here on the, the Flybe website, all the details here, and uh, enjoy this service.